DJI's latest drone is a bit of an engineering marvel. Sure, the Mavic Air isn't quite smartphone size like the company suggested, but it's plenty small and portable enough to be carried around in a pocket when folded up. The Air is the latest addition to the drone giant's line of consumer-facing quadcopters, slotting in somewhere between the Mavic Pro and Spark. It starts at $799, that's $700 less than the Pro, but it's actually better in a number of ways. Responsiveness has been improved, and there are a number of cool video modes including Boomerang and Asteroid. DJI is marketing the Air as its most mainstream drone to date, but even the most user-friendly drones still take some ramping up. The control scheme, which uses a combination of the remote control and a smartphone, takes some getting used to, and it's still possible to slam the thing into a tree, which we learned the hard way. Ditto for gesture control. It's a cool capability, but it's far from perfect. If you're new to the drone game, I'd recommend giving yourself some ample training time, and a few spare batteries, since you'll get about 21 minutes max each. Still, the whole of the Air experience is pretty polished, and the 4K video speaks for itself, especially when running it through the magic editing of the company's mobile app. The Air's not perfect, and it's certainly not idiot-proof, but it's a key step toward a truly mainstream drone.